Bonjour. Welcome to our culinary journey through French cuisine. Today, we embark on an exploration of the legendary croque monsieur. But before we indulge in its delicious flavors, let's uncover some intriguing unknown facts about this classic French treat. Did you know that the croque monsieur traces its origins back to early 20th century Parisian cafes? Legend has it that the dish was invented by French workers who sought a quick and satisfying meal during their lunch breaks. Originally known simply as a croque, meaning to crunch, it consisted of ham and cheese sandwiched between slices of bread and grilled to crispy perfection. Surprisingly, the croque monsieur's rise to fame is attributed to its inclusion on the menus of Parisian cafes and brasseries frequented by artists, intellectuals, and bohemians. As word spread of its irresistible combination of flavors and textures, the croque monsieur became a symbol of Parisian gastronomy and cultural sophistication. Its presence in literature, films, and popular culture further solidified its status as an iconic French dish. An interesting unknown fact about the croque monsieur is its close relative, the croque madame. Similar in concept, the croque madame adds a fried egg on top of a sandwich, elevating it to new heights of indulgence. Legend has it that the name, Croque Madame, was coined by Parisian cafe owners as a playful nod to the feminine flair of the dish, likening it to a stylish French mademoiselle. Despite its French origins, the Croque Monsieur has gained popularity worldwide, captivating the palates of food enthusiasts across the globe. In cities like New York, London, and Tokyo, you'll find variations of the Croque Monsieur on menus of trendy cafes and bistros, each putting their own spin on this classic dish. Its enduring appeal transcends borders and cultures, proving that good taste knows no boundaries. An intriguing unknown fact about croque monsieur is its place in French culinary etiquette. While it may seem like a simple sandwich, there are unwritten rules about how to enjoy it properly. Traditionally, croque monsieur is eaten with a knife and fork, rather than with the hands, especially in more formal settings. Surprisingly, croque monsieur has made its mark in French literature appearing in novels, poems, and essays as a symbol of Parisian life and culture. Writers often use the dish to evoke the ambiance of bustling cafes and the charm of French society. In works by authors such as Marcel Proust and Colette, Croque Monsieur serves as a culinary motif, capturing the essence of everyday life in Paris and the pleasures of indulging in simple yet satisfying fare. Croque Monsieur has made cameo appearances in numerous French films, serving as a culinary prop that enhances scenes set in Parisian cafes and bistros. From romantic comedies to gritty dramas, the sight of characters enjoying a croque monsieur adds authenticity and charm to cinematic narratives. Directors often use the dish to evoke a sense of nostalgia for viewers. In the world of art, croque monsieur has been immortalized in paintings, sculptures, and other forms of visual expression. Artists are drawn to its iconic silhouette and vibrant colors, using it as a subject to explore themes of indulgence, pleasure, and cultural identity. Whether depicted in a still life or as part of a larger tableau, the croque monsieur serves as a symbol of French gastronomy and the enduring allure of Parisian cuisine. Interestingly, croque monsieur has become intertwined with French sports culture, particularly in the realm of tennis. In France, it is a tradition for spectators and players alike to enjoy croque monsieur sandwiches while attending tennis tournaments such as the French Open. The dish's portability and satisfying flavors make it the perfect choice for a quick and hearty meal between matches, adding to the festive atmosphere of the sporting event. Croque monsieur's legacy extends beyond traditional French cuisine, influencing modern culinary trends around the world. Chefs and restaurateurs often draw inspiration from the dish's combination of flavors and textures, incorporating elements of croque monsieur into innovative recipes. Surprisingly, croque monsieur has found its way into the lyrics of French songs, becoming a lyrical motif that reflects the country's culinary heritage and joie de vivre. Musicians often reference the dish in songs celebrating the pleasures of everyday life, adding a touch of whimsy and nostalgia to their lyrics. Whether sung about in a playful manner or as a symbol of comfort and indulgence. And there you have it. A glimpse into the delicious world of croque monsieur. Where simplicity meets sophistication. And every bite is a taste of Parisian charm. Whether enjoyed in a cozy cafe or made at home with love. May your experience with croque monsieur be filled with joy, flavor, and a touch of French elegance. 
Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe our channel.